Hello friends, welcome to my channel, myself Pral Gambulkar. In this video, we will see how to make group of similar test cases in test in framework. Now see, here we have this example. Inside this test tag, we have mentioned classes, program 1, program 2 and program 3. My test is package name. Now see, in program 1 class, we have two test cases. One is login to admission module and broken links of admission module. Then in program 2 class, Again, we have two test cases. One is login to placement module of the college website and finding broken links of placement module of that college website. In program three class, again, we have two test cases. One is login to faculty module and another is finding broken links of faculty module of this college website. Now see, if you check all these programs have login test cases, right? Here is also login, here is also login, right? Now see, suppose there is a requirement that you want to execute only login test cases in that situation what we have to do we have to make group of this login test cases right this login test cases are distributed among the different classes but suppose there is a requirement that you want to run only login test cases or suppose there is a requirement that you have to skip only login test cases all others you have to execute suppose there is such a requirement in that case you require group of this login test cases right now see here in this example, we will make group of this login test cases. Now, how to do that? We will see in this example. Now, see. So, this is admission login test case, right? Now, we want to make group of this login test case, right? So, see. Here in round bracket, what you have to do? Here, you have to mention groups. Groups. Then, is equal to any curly bracket. See, in this curly bracket, you have to give name of this group so suppose i want to mention name suppose login okay any name you can give this is the name we have given to this group okay so what is the meaning of this this test case belong to group login now see in program 2.java so again same thing so what we want to do we want to mention the test case in we want to include this test case in group login right so same thing we'll do in round bracket here we'll mention groups is equal to in curly bracket in double quote we will mention group name okay same group name you have to give so see here also we have mentioned login same group name here you have to mention right again same thing will do again this is login test case so in this round bracket here we will mention groups is equal to in curly bracket in double quote we will give the group name right so by this we have formed group of login test cases right so this login test case from this class this login test case from this class and this login test case from this class right so that we have done now see i have opened this testng.xml file now see here you will use it here we will make use of this login group now how to make that tools here we have mentioned all the classes right we have mentioned all the classes what is the meaning of this all the test cases from these classes will get run right that is the meaning of this now see here I want to make use of this group so see how i am doing it see here i am using this group stack right now see inside that i am using one more tag run right now see suppose uh, there is a requirement that i want to run only login test case right i want to run only login test cases so see how i can do i have to include name is equal to in double quote i have to provide this name login right so here we will end it like this right so what is the meaning of this or uh, we can write like this also so see like this so see we want to include all the login test cases so see, this is the group name so when this xml file will get run so when we are running test cases from these classes at the time we want to include login test cases right so only this test cases will get run because already we have seen what is the use of include and exclude right so when we are mentioning include that means only uh, test cases from this group will get run so see we will run it now see so see here you can see we got the output from the login test case only right only login test cases are run right 
Now suppose uh, there is a requirement that uh, you want to run all other test cases except login test cases. Means you want to run all the test cases, but you want to skip login test cases. So that also we can do. How we can do? Instead of include, just we have to mention exclude, right? Exclude. So here also we can. Here you also you will make change, right? Exclude. So see now we will run it. So see here we got the output except login test cases, right? So all other test cases except login test cases are run, right? So in this way we can make group of test cases, similar test cases, and accordingly we have to mention in this XML file. So see suppose you want to make group. So here in round bracket we have to mention that groups is equal to in curly bracket in double quote we have to give name of the group. So see likewise here we have done that, right? And then in XML file inside this groups tag, okay, there you have to mention this run tag, and there you can use you can mention it include or exclude accordingly as per your need. You can mention there, you can use there, right? So, friends, I hope you like this video. If it is, then click on like, subscribe to the channel, and don't forget to press the bell icon so that you will get notification of my next video. So, stay connected. Thank you.